constitution is flawed in the sense that change of government takes place automatically after the day of swearing in. The Attorney General and the Solicitor General fall away, leaving a huge lacuna, a gap in the management of public affairs. And you can only bring in the Attorney General and the Solicitor General upon going through the processes of approvals or vetting, including Parliament, which Parliament is not yet in place. How can people frame? You are lawyers. How did you frame, you lawyers, how did you frame this constitution? How? How did you do it? Because the President is sworn in, he has no Attorney General, he has no Solicitor General, and to bring this to, he needs a length process which requires Parliament. Parliament doesn't sit until after a number of weeks. So these are the issues that we expect you to guide this government, to quickly checklist the lacunas in the Constitution. Working with the Law Association of Zambia, working with other stakeholders, because the law is not a preserve of lawyers, I must also say that. It's a preserve of the people who own the laws. So let us consult. So this is one of your early assignments to do the checklist in consultation with others, such lacunas that make it difficult. Two months in government, we're only getting Attorney General and Solicitor General now. And even then, we had to push a bit. So something is wrong.